Hi there, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to this glorious day in Norway with my twin brother. Today we're going up to uh, a place called Kalhot. We've never been there before. That means there are a little bit of gravel riding today. And uh, we're also going to talk about what is adventure. Yeah, what is adventure? Is it two hours, one day, two days, three weeks, one year, four years? Yeah, what can you call an adventure? Yeah. Road intro! <sighs> yeah, it's a glorious day! A glorious day in my part of Norway today! And uh, it's one of the warmest days we had so far this summer and me and my brother have decided to go to a place called Kalhot I've been recommended to ride up there and, uh, there's supposed to be some gravel roads too but mostly tarmac today but uh, these are fun roads and uh, 30 minutes from home, we got twisty heaven. Beautiful telemark. We got this right outside our doorstep. And that's what I was going to talk about today. Adventure. What is adventure? Is it one day? Two days? One month? Two months? One year? Two years? For me it isn't. This is adventure for me. We're uh, going to a place we've never been before and uh, <laughs> that is a little adventure. Uh, we live in an area in Norway where you can have an adventure every day. We got great, uh, where I live we get great hiking possibilities just behind our house. And uh, yeah, I get accommodated. Uh, somebody told me that uh, I was going on an adventure on the bike and I said, how long are we going to be away? Ah, uh, Thursday to Sunday and they said, that's not a proper adventure but I disagree, I disagree So what do you think adventure is? Is it to be away for a long time? Is uh, adventure just outside your doorstep? For me it is Next weekend we're also going on another adventure. We're going to be away for three days, but uh, that's adventure. So, uh, the one that told me that what we do isn't adventure, you're wrong. Completely wrong. But I can't be away for three months, one year. That's out of the question. I got a family to support. Yeah, fun road. Even it's tarmac. A beautiful scenery. Beautiful adventure. Look. Never been here before. Hmm? Huh? Oh fuck! That was a bummer. Oh, we passed the sign a little bit further down that said uh, roadworks, but that had a big cross over it. So we thought, yeah, it's open, but no. Norway. Oh, locales. So that's a shame, but uh, there is a road down here somewhere but I think it's uh, open, a toll road but it's an end road but it follows the river down in the valley here so uh, maybe we're gonna check that out yeah we found the road and as always here in this country we have to pay a toll 
And then we find uh, the VIPs. There's the VIPs. 50 Norwegian kroner. This better be good. <laughs> and I'm faffing with my phone. Oh Jesus, I'm faffing with my phone. Yeah, so this we found ourselves a little bit of gravel. 50 Norwegian kroner, about uh, how much is that? 6 euros, 5.5 euros. But uh, this is a tourist road. This place is riding like a tourist, so yeah, let's see what we got here. Oh, this is pretty nice, isn't it? This is very nice. Cool to find places you've never seen before. You have to pay for it, but uh, there's nothing free here in this country. This is one and a half hour for where we live. <laughs> I don't have to go away for a year. I got adventure just outside my doorstep. <laughs> What's the speed limit here? Huh? Is it 80, 90, 100? Or is it 30, 40 or 50? I guess uh, the last three. <laughs> so this is what we came for. Some gravel in the middle of a work week. I think we're going to see some great views on this uh, gravel road. The river is on our right, I think. This fucking, fucking bike! Now it's in street mode, why the fuck are you in street mode? Yeah, this was proper! Thomas and Espen likes. A oh. little bit slippery on the edges here. Search for gravel pays off tonight too. I wonder how long this uh, road is. Espen has problems with his contact lens. Shut the camera. There we go. This was good. Abra. Yeah. But it's slippery in some places. A fun to track. Give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, ding the bell, and leave a little comment. I think there's a view Esme is looking for, or a place to have coffee, I think. 
What a beautiful spot. Huh? This was awesome. Really awesome. Yeah, but a really nice two track. We have succeeded. Yeah, we're gonna have some iced coffee now. Some Starbucks. Is it safe? Is the bridge safe? <laughs> he can't hear me. He's deaf. Esper doesn't have all that electronic shit that I have on my bike, but uh, now it's working. But uh, just wait, just wait. So I had a iced coffee from Starbucks, caramel macchiato, that was nice. Had a Snickers, always have a Snickers when you're out riding off road, and a pizza bun from my wife. Thank you, Cecil. I can feel that I'm pretty sweaty after standing on that bridge. I think this is an end road somewhere. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> this was the road up to the place we were instead, where we thought we could uh, we thought we could uh, go up again, but it's closed. So there's a road up to the left, the other side of the bridge. We're going to take that and see how far that goes. No vid with a uh, simple guy on two wheels and his brother without a U-turn. Back over the bridge. Up to the right here. Let's see what, where this brings us. This was worth six euros, I can tell you that. Worth every penny. Whoa! I'm definitely coming back here, definitely. There's something nice to see around every corner. We found the gem, bro! We found the gem! Look down there! Whoa! Adventure, not far from home. Again, comment if you disagree with me, but uh, I call this an adventure. Big little adventure. <laughs> Yeah, but me and my brother have started doing this. When we go out riding, we uh, scout for roads, for unpaved roads. And uh, I think this road goes pretty far. Oh, look at this! Nice! This made my week. I want to be one happy NV rider at work tomorrow. And we got mountains right in front of us. Wow. And we even got snow up there. 
Det är bra att tempo i det, Espen. Vi har några old settlements här. Och en liten lovely two-track. We almost missed the turn off to this road. We uh, just went up to the where we got stopped because roads were closed. But Esther saw it when we were heading up that uh, it was a toll road, and uh, this is the end. <laughs> Off-road mode is fucked up again. The service didn't help at all. Oh, that was stupid. Let's go this way. <laughs> But how long was this? Was it uh, six, seven k's? About that. My brother is going out scouting to see if this is doable. Looks like some very big rocks over there. Take the ignition off. <laughs> But my electronics are not sorted, so I have to order that unit I talked about. That means another day off from work just to go to Oslo to sort this out. Annoying. Yeah, let's go back. Whew. Electronics, oh, it's getting on my nerves now. But uh, that's how it is. When you look at this vid, I would have probably have sorted this out. But uh, right now, it's bloody annoying because I was on service about four days ago, and uh, they said if it isn't sorted, you have to uh, order a unit. It isn't sorted. God damn it! But this place is marked on the map and uh, we're gonna go here more, more this summer because this was a good stretch to practice on. Good gravel surface, get up and down, like bumpy, hard and loose, everything. And again, give a like, subscribe, ding the bell, highly appreciated. Now oh, it's okay again. Huh. Morden, we gotta sort you out. Call my dealership tomorrow and ask them to order that unit. That was a little fast, Thomas. <laughs> Fans are dropping into the river because it's very warm. So uh, <laughs> this was a fun part. We really like this. I tell you, this party is real good for speed. <laughs> whoa. whoa, 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 whoa! Cut down to the rut here. <laughs> oh, 
hell of a lot of fun. Yeah, rock. <laughs> Don't want to hit that. Whoa. There we go, water. <laughs> we got the loose stuff. More speed, this one, more speed. So much fun now. Woo! When you scout, you find. I got also new tires on my bike. Oh, oh the grass is pretty slippery. <laughs> oh, had a moment there. Oh, rest a little bit. That was hell of a lot of fun, hell of a lot of fun. We're not finished. Ooh. This is addictive. <laughs> this is almost as good as drinking beer. Out of the forest. <laughs> yeah, we can try up there another time. Fuel for the soul. When you get to do this with your twin brother, your best mate, doesn't get any better than that. 
Oh, that was fun. That was it. I'm going to use the word awesome again because that was awesome. <laughs> oh, fuck you, off road mode. Gotta run for our money there. Six euros. Yeah. Worth every penny. Great work, Espel. Great work. Oh, had a few, few sketchy moments, but uh, that's only keeps you awake. <laughs> I knew this was going to be good. <laughs> Feel the force. May the force be with you, Thomas. And Espen. <laughs> what the fuck? Neutral? Just ran into neutral. Oh, there's something wrong with you still, Nordy. You have to take you to the doctor again. Oh, few farm. One, two, three. Sink. <laughs> I'm so stoked right now. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, like we talked about earlier, adventure it doesn't have to be that long. We rode maybe five or six k's now on the gravel road, and uh, never been there. Going back, definitely. We just go up there in the morning, go back and forward, make camp at the end, and just go back and forward all day practicing. Thanks for a lovely time, bro. Yeah. We have been to the store, at the Kiwi store, and bought a couple of beers to have when we get home. But uh, that was the end of today's ride. Did you enjoy it, bro? Prima, prima. Okay. So, uh, if you like this vid, give it a like. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. And ding the notification bell. So for me, simple down two wheels and yeah, him. <laughs> we can't see you. There you are! <laughs> See you next time people! Bye!